So one important aspect of managing your container in a swarm cluster is basically the data. You maybe want to have a single volume that is used by many containers scatter over the cluster. In this case, using your host is not going to, get to, to, to be enough. In this case, you can use the support for volume plugins and volumes in general to create volumes that will be scattered across your, your, your entire cluster. So here I take the, the, the example of the Ceph cluster. I can go through the Docker volume command and create through the plugin a volume here on the Ceph cluster that is maybe going to be used by many containers. This ensures that the state can be distributed and fault tolerant mostly for your containers. You have tons of plugins like Cluster HQ plugin with ZFS that allows you to migrate your containers and your data together. And yeah, that's it. Thank you. So this was a very basic and raw overview of what Swarm is. I hope you have a better understanding of what the project is and what the purpose of Swarm is to actually manage your Docker engines at scale. You can contact us on IRC on the channel Docker Swarm or also contact us on GitHub in the Swarm project. You can submit new issues or, or just talk to us generally if you have any problems with our project. So thank you. <laughs>